Hello everybody, I'm Chris Segrell, Principal of Christ the King School, and I'm here with... Amy Becker, Assistant Principal of Christ the King School. And this particular topic is going to be on the free lunch program that applies now to all Christ the King families. And this is something very new that we kind of just fell into and we discovered, um, but the uh, United States Department of Agri Agriculture extended what they call the Summer Food Service Program. This is where they provide free meals during the summer. We've never been in a program like that. We just have our normal, regular lunch program here at Christ the King. Uh, but they extended the summer program to include all schools, really, in the United States, and where you could apply for this summer program and effectively get free lunch, hot lunches, for all of your students in school. So I did apply for that in early October. We were approved. And uh, so we fall under that program effective the 1st of October. So what that means for all of, all of you, all of our students here at Christ the King, is every student is entitled to a free hot lunch each day that they're in school. Uh, got to be in school. If you're a remote learner, that really doesn't apply to you. You got to be in the school building to participate in this, uh, which just makes sense. But uh, so, um, so that that actually that started right right away. Um, what I had Mr. Odom do, since it's retroactive back to the first of October, is he has already done this. I mean, I told him to kind of wait till we did the video, but he got on it right some away. Some of you have noticed and called Mrs. Andrews, and she has. Okay. Explain. So some of you already know about this. Okay, yeah. all right, that's good. But Mr. Odom, he went back and he credited everyone's account for all of the hot lunch meals in October. And then he zeroized the price for November. So anybody who got a hot, hot lunch starting in November wasn't even charged for it. Now I want to just say that this applies to hot lunches only, not extra portions. You had to pay for the extra portions. And if you do decide to bring a cold lunch and order a milk, it does not cover the cost of the milk. So if you get an extra portion or if you get a milk as a side separate item, you are charged for that. So, but it applies to hot lunch. We think we're gonna probably see a lot more hot lunches here. I, I wouldn't blame you. Um, it's a kind of a perk, kind of to help families. Um, you know, the United States government realizes that this is a tough time with COVID going on and it strains really all families. Some families it really strains a lot and some maybe not as much, but everyone is affected and impacted in some way. So this is just kind of a nice thing uh, that is being offered and uh, so many schools are taking advantage of it and we thought it, it, it made sense for us to help you guys out to take advantage of that as well. Um, this is expected to continue until the funds are no longer available, but because they've renewed a few things, it's expected to go on through the rest of the school year. That's what we're being told right now. So if you're a family and you have an auto withdrawal taken out of your bank account and money goes into your lunch account automatically every month or whenever it does, you might want to get with your bank and stop that because that's really not going to be necessary uh, for this school year. We will let you know if anything changes, but the projection right now is that free lunches will be available to all students here at Christ the King for the remainder of the school year. We think that's a super thing for our families, and so we know Pizza Hut Pizza Day is a crazy day right now, <laughs> and I have a feeling it's going to get even crazier. But we'll be ready for it, and uh, we hope to see a whole lot of hot lunches yeah. out there. So. If you do have any questions about this particular program, call the office or shoot me an email or Mrs. Becker an email. We'd be happy to answer any questions that you might have. Um, and I think we're pretty, yeah. pretty good with that. Yeah. All right, this concludes this topic. Thanks again for all your support, all your help out there, all your prayers for all of us, and God bless. Take care now. Bye.